name is Darby Gase, and I'm here to talk to you about your first impression. Your first impression on the phone, not face to face. And I'll tell you the first important thing you need to do is smile with your voice. I know you're talking to yourself and you're going, smile? I'm on the phone. Who am I going to smile to? Smile to the wall. Smile to your plant. Smile to your fingers. If you sound like you're happy, the person you're talking to realizes that you're happy and they're engaged in the phone call. Your next impression is how you want to explain or sell your product. You don't want to sell the whole thing in the first 15 seconds. You don't want to give them the entire company history. Make it a brief and quick statement and they will be engaged with you. If you can explain to them in a one to two sentence on what you're doing and what you're trying to accomplish and you sound knowledgeable, they will believe you. That's the big thing, belief. If they can believe you, they're engaged and they'll take the call. If you sound bored or you sound like you don't know what you're talking about or you're reading from a script, shh, maybe you are reading from a script but you don't have to sound like you're reading from a script, they'll understand you and they'll know who to get to to give you the right person, especially if you're trying to call somebody and you get to what they call as a gatekeeper, the person who may not be the decision maker of your company, but who knows that person is or who knows who that person is and they can get them to, they can get you to them. Uh, you want to make sure you do that really quickly. I'm probably rambling on in this post, but what you want to explain is don't do as I do, do as I say. Make it quick. Make your first impression count because you only have 10 seconds to make it worth your while and if you can do it, you'll go far in this business.